Welcome to this week's edition of the Falcon Report. This week is January 31st through February 4th. Let's check in with our reporter in kindergarten. Hi, my name is Zeke. I'm with Emma and Parker from Miss McDaniel's class. What little letter are you working on? H. That's right. What sound does H make? <sighs> Good job. What are some things that start with H? House and horse. Great. Thank you, kindergarten. Now back to our reporter for this week story highlights. Our high flyers for creativity are Kindergarten Jones, first Kellen, Lexi, and Ben, second Bryn, third Asia and Jason, fourth Poppy and Lainey, and fifth Lucy, Brielle, and Kyson. Way to go, high flyers. We currently have 74,450 free care cards. Our goal is 85,000. Keep up the good work, Falcons. Hello, Sprucewood Falcons. It's Principal Skino here to send a huge shout out to Miss Angie and her entire team that works in our cafeteria for National Pride in Food Service Week. First, we just want to say we love all of you. Thank you for taking care of us each day and making sure that we have everything we need when we come into the cafeteria. And Falcons, remember that please and thank you that you use every day is your way of showing thanks every time you go through our lunchroom. Have a great lunch. Hey, Sprucewood Falcons, welcome to our kitchen. I'll just show you what we do every day. First thing, we'll come over and we look at our list and see what's on the menu for the day. And each of our name is highlighted for what we have. So today I'm doing veggie sticks and, and bananas and peaches. This is the steamer where we steam the rice and the veggies and and I think they even do the nacho cheese in here we can do lots of things in the steamer this is our hand washing station you have to make sure we have clean hands when we prepare your food this is a stove top oven where we can melt butter and cook the soup or saute veggies and then here's our ovens this is a really co cool machine. We like to do even the fries and the tater tots and the pizza in here. It makes it really good. It's a, it's a professional cooking machine. And this is our dishwasher. So I'll show you guys how we do it. We just put the dishes in one of these trays and we just push it on through the dishwasher. This is our freezer. This is where we keep a lot of the food that we make for you guys. This is another food storage area where we keep a lot of the fruit and beans and chips and cereal. We keep a lot of our food in here. We even have a washer and dryer to wash all our aprons and rags that we use to clean off the tables. This is a fridge that we put the fruit for the day in after we prepared it. And this is where we get to serve you lunch. We, this keeps the food warm for you. We put the food in here, and this light keeps it warm too. Thank you, Sprucewood Falcons, for always saying please and thank you. We love serving you. Hello, I am with Dean this morning. Do you have a favorite snack? Yes, I, I love fruit snacks. What do you like to read? Nonfiction. What would people be surprised to learn about you? 
I am from Japan and America. I was born in a, a country called UAE. Wow. When you grow up, what do you want to be? A soccer player. What are three things you love? Soccer, Minecraft, and biographies. Cool. Is there anything else you would like to share with us? Let's see, this is a Japanese toy. What you have to do, you have to try to get the ball on the bottom side or on the top without using your hands. Good job. This is a Japanese spin, spinning top. What it does, if you spin it, um, after a few seconds, it will stand up. Cool. We do Japanese choreography every single year. And um, the thing I write it says, um, Happy New Year. This is the um, Cherry Blossom Festival in Japan. There's a lot of food stands or you can get a candy or snacks and there's a lot of cherry blossoms. That's nice. This is a Japanese manga. This is the American version. This is the Japanese version. This was released before my mom was born. That's about it. Thank you, Dean, for sharing with us. Thanks. Welcome. Fifth grade parents, you can go online now to do the virtual orientation. Registration for middle school is due February 18th. If you have any questions, please contact the middle school your student will be attending. Here's what's happening at Spearswood this week. Today, the University of Utah will be presenting to the fifth grade Tuesday, Indian Hills and Mount Jordan will be presenting to 5th grade. Thursday, Loveland Aquarium will be presenting to 4th grade. Have a great week, Falcons.